Well, good morning, guys. My name's Trevor. Welcome back to the Arctic Vet YouTube channel. Sorry, I'm not feeling that great today. And I happen to just, I happen to just leave the chiropractor. And man, it hit me. I was like, you know, he asked, how you doing? And I'm just, I'm not doing too great. I don't feel that great. I, I woke up, my face is hurt. My nose is running. I got flaming everywhere. All right, all right. And then he's he's popping and bending me and snapping and cracking and getting everything back aligned. And he's like, "Oh yeah, boy. Oof. I can tell your science is really throwing you a fit." I'm like, "Yeah, it's kicking my butt right now." Well, I got you on some elderberry. That's it. That's it right there. It's like no, but I'm taking some some of uh, this Deutera essential stuff, oils, vitamins, and things like that, and they help clear it up, but it's not kicking it. Elderberry, elderberry is also a very good. Um, el it's elderberry juice, and it's 100% concentrate, concentrate. And I completely forgot about this stuff, but I have some. And the best part is, is that for weeks, Cohen's been saying, Dad, you need to get you some elderberry. You need to take some elderberry. I'm like, no, I'm all right. I'm good. He knew. <laughs> it's funny. It's funny how kids know. Sometimes we just got to slow down and listen to them. But anyhow, now that I'm all popped back in place and such, Ooh, kind of tired. I don't know why, but every time I get readjusted, I just want to go take a nap. And usually I do get a nap in afterwards and then go on about the day and do pretty good. This helps like kickstart the everything. But anyways, what I wanted to, what I really wanted to talk about, we better get into before it's too much longer. So without further ado, let's read our devotional and roll that intro Boop. all right so today is tuesday august 24th and our devotional in our jesus calling book today it reads i am all around you hovering over you even as you seek my face i am nearer than you dare believe closer than the air you breathe if my child my children could only recognize my presence they would never feel alone again i know every thought before you think it every word before you speak it my presence impings on your innermost being can you see the absurdity of trying to hide anything from me you can easily deceive other people and even yourself but i read you like an open book large an open large print book deep within themselves most people have some awareness of my intimate Im imminent presence many people run from me and vehemently vehemently i think that's right deny my existence because my closeness terrifies them but my own children have nothing to fear for i have cleansed them by my blood and clothe them in my righteousness be blessed by my intimate nearness since i live in you let me also live through you shining my light into the darkness even into your life because I know for me it 
some days they they hit a little harder at home than other days and that's gonna happen and that's totally okay so as some may know I suffer from allergies of ev literally everything if you were to go to the doctor and ask to have an allergy test done everything that they put on your back they have like these little they're like 16 per box thing that they poke your, your back with and um, well let's just say that there's like four of those and every single one of them I go I I get sick like I have a reaction to that's what I'm looking for I have a reaction to them. every one of them except for the mouse I'm apparently not allergic to a mouse but I'm allergic to dust I'm allergic to trees, plants, grasses, pollen, you name it, cats, dogs, animals, I'm allergic to them. <laughs> and what that means for me is that usually my nose will start running, my eyes will start watering and get itchy, but the worst, the worst of it is that on my arms, if I do start petting, say, a cat or a dog, my arms will start breaking out with, in a rash, and it, it burns like it's it's like fire. It hurts, and so to things that I can do to better this is one: I could go to the doctor and I could get allergy shots. Now those allergy shots you have to do it, at first. It's like every week, and you get like three shots a week. You get two in one arm, one in the other, and then the next week they'll do two in the other, and then one in the one that you got two on. So they alternate it. But what that's doing is that's helping your immune system build up to the cats, the dogs, to your allergies, to your allergies, okay? That's what it's doing. And and that's great and it works, but I have to do that for five years. And then I'll have about 10 years where I don't have to do it and I'll, I'll do pretty good. But at that, about the end of that 10 years, I'll need them again. And I know this because I've already done this. I used, as a kid, I was allergic to not quite as much. And then 10 years go by, though five years of shots and I did great. And then 10 years go by and it started coming back. So, what I'm trying to do now, that's cool. Is that an actual airplane or like an RC plane? <laughs> I don't know. It's out here by my favorite house. I love your house. <laughs> and if you're watching, you probably know who you are. <laughs> Just say it's a log cabin house. Beautiful. Inside and out. Anyways. So my allergies, right, they... They're, they're pretty bad. And instead of going to the doctor and having to pay hundreds of thousands of dollars to get allergy shots, instead, one, I go to my chiropractor. Because getting your body aligned and getting everything put back where it's supposed to be is a big step to mental health, the physical health, the, your health in general. Okay, I'm not, I'm not a doctor, I'm just, I've been through it and this is what works for me. And maybe it'll work for you. It is, it is a fine, it is a big point. That's pretty sweet. Trying to flash the kid with the light. There's a lot of places you can put it, 
and it'll it helps certain oils help for certain things and I do lemon lavender peppermint those three together are the ultimate trio for allergies and honestly it, it helps a ton so if I go pet a dog and I start breaking out I rub that on my on where I was where it's breaking out and it'll stop burning and it'll start going away that's how amazing some essential oils can be so then the third thing that I do which I mentioned is elderberry juice and I forgot all about it because usually I only do it when my nose starts flaring up like this my sinuses start kicking my butt that's really the only time that I actually use my elderberry because it it goes in and like kicks butt I don't know what it does or how it works but it's some really good also all natural stuff and so all three of these things are all natural and they're not I'm not putting anti antibiotics in my body I'm not going to the doctor all the time and spending boo poo bucks because believe me I've done it I've done it last year spent like thirty thousand dollars somewhere in there in medical bills because of everything going on you guys remember my stomach well guess what my stomach also doing those three things I'm healing my gut it's getting better and I know this because I'm not in the bathroom constantly now yes I do watch what I eat and that that plays a big role in it but once my gut is healed I might be able to go back and eat some some cheese or have some ice cream but right now I can't have that dairy stuff which is also kind of funny because I had some non-dairy cheese and it, it really upset my stomach so I'm not going to eat non-dairy cheese either I think cheese is just once in a while kind of thing that I can do I'm not going to do it all the time but anyways I, I wanted to share with you guys the things that I do personally to help me with my allergies and right now I can feel it it's clearing up there's still there's still pressure and I can feel it starting to to release just by going to the chiropractor so if, if you or somebody you know struggle with allergies like this go ahead and share this video with them tell, tell them what I do I mean and, and if you got questions, don't be afraid to shoot me an email or find me on Instagram, Facebook, send me a message because I'm there and I, I do get take messages there. If this, and one of the easiest ways that you can do is to just drop a comment down below real quick and say, hey, we can start talking. Now, of course, that's more of a public form of communication. But if, if you're okay with that, that's okay with me. I don't, it doesn't bother me a bit to share what I know, what I've done, what I go through to help you out. So, anyways, just want to thank God for all, all these things, all these blessings, and all these struggles. Because without them, I wouldn't be here and I wouldn't be telling you guys this kind of stuff. I would be sharing my experiences with you, my testimonies with you. So we're getting closer to baptism day. I'm super excited about it. Riley's pretty excited. Adi is still not going to do it. He's he set on waiting and I'm totally okay with that. And the crazy, crazy part about it is um, I feel I feel really good about inviting their mom, and usually I don't feel good about inviting her to anything, such as like our the boys and I things, because I just it's not my thing. I don't. But this this is something great. It's gonna be great. So, anyhow, and I'm trying to trying to be trying to grow and become a better Christian and a better child of God. And I know with time, with time I will, and I'll continue to have more trials, more tribulations.
that thumbs up. Don't forget, you can get yourself some Arctic Vet merch at arcticvet.com and then click on store. And we have hats, t-shirts, hoodies, masks, I mean, pants. We got it all, guys. We got it all. And I just came out, I wish I had it on. I just came out with the Faith Family Fun shirt and I absolutely love it. It's, it's definitely my favorite. We do have the OG shirt on there. And currently I have, I've had this like vision of my website come to me. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna start working on my website some more. I actually did yesterday and maybe again today, get it like looking, looking cool, looking at, looking nice. I don't, I don't know. I just, this came to me. And so when stuff like this comes to me, I just, I gotta do it. I gotta get it on, on done. So look forward to that it's going to be pretty neat we have cars and coffee coming up this weekend i'll definitely be talking about that more in another video coming soon because i'm really excited about that so i hope that you all have a wonderful day have a blessed day and god bless y'all all right let's let's see if we can catch these guys I gotta try to be quiet though. So last time they were way out there, right? Oh, there's a yep, see look, 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 look. Look at them, look at them. Look at all those turkeys. Holy moly. Look at them all. You guys see that right there? Look at all of them. There they go. How many are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven or twelve? Forgive my counting, but that is so cool. That is so cool. Got a big old bird up there. That is so cool. Alright. Alright, that's awesome. We're gonna leave them be now. Let them eat. <laughs> that's so awesome. Thank you, Lord.